guys, welcome back to my channel and to a brand new video. Today's video is going to be another bag centric video and it's going to be a full brand review of Bella Road bags and accessories that I have in my collection and that I've had the pleasure of trying. I have a few friends joining me today. Now, Bellroy is a bags and accessories brand based in Australia, but available everywhere because the internet has connected us all together. And because of their considered designs and the materials that they use, they do fit in that premium category. And if you've met a Bellroy bag before, then you'll understand why, because of the who's it's and what's it's galore that are packed inside the bag. And if you haven't, well then I'm here to make that introduction for you. Huzzah! It gives me great pleasure to review this brand and to put together this video for you, because if you rewind back over a year ago, I was in the hunt for a stylish backpack for me to take to work, and I came across the Bellroy Tokyo Tote Pack. <laughs> And after a lot of consideration, I bought it. At the time, I was a little bit apprehensive about it all and I thought it was a risk when I bought it because when I was hunting for reviews of the Tokyo Tote Pack, none of the reviews were by women. They were all from men. They were all very tall. They didn't necessarily work in the same field as me. And so I just felt like maybe I was going out on a limb too much, but it ticked all the boxes in terms of functionality and compartments and all that jazz. And I just haven't been disappointed with it. I think it's obvious with all of the Instagram reels that Seen. And it's also inspired by some pretty classy moves. Now in today's video, I'm featuring a range of products that I have bought myself from Bellroy, as well as ones that Bellroy have sent to me for review purposes. I'm going to cover off their signature bags as well as their accessories. And this video is sponsored by Bellroy. So I want to say thanks to the Bellroy team for supporting what I do and for making this video possible. So I work full time as a lawyer in Sydney and I work a hybrid week, which is a path well trodden, I think for a lot of us. I work three days a week from home and two days a week from the office. And I commute to the office via public transport or walking. I also have small humans that I drop off at their various institutions and so there's a lot of wrangling going on there's a lot of hands that are required as you can see we have a lot of things to cover and I'm going to cover off the essentials including a little bit about each of the bags functionality weight devices that they comfortably fit and you will see how the bags look on my person I am 5'2 by the way 158 centimeters tall and so chances are you are probably taller than me it's not that hard I'm gonna kick things off with bags because this is how the love story between me and Belroy started. And it all kicked off with this guy, the Tokyo Tote Pack. This is my very first Belroy bag that I ever added to my collection and I'm sure that it is familiar to you guys. It's featured in several videos on my YouTube channel already and it's featured in many, many, many reels. Now, purely because of how long it's been in my collection, it is my most used bag. I have the 20 litre Tokyo Tote Pack. It also comes in a smaller 14 litre version as well. That's the compact tote pack. Now I got myself the 20 litre because I did a lot of research before I bought this bag and this bag would be fit for the purpose that I needed to use it for. And it fits everything that I need to take with me to the office. It has a separate section here which is padded for laptops and it fits my 15 inch work laptop easily. It just swallows it up. There's a tablet section. There is a meshed zipped compartment which is really stretchy and it provides that flexibility for when you're carrying cables like your charging cables or your little knickknacks that always end up falling into the bottom of your bag. All of the compartments just make it really easy to keep things really organized. I've got a hot desk at work and so I'm like a snail. I need to carry all my things with me, make sure that they're neat and then unpack them onto my desk and then pack up at the end of the day. And so when everything's a mess, which they tended to get in a messy state when I was using my designer tote bags, I just didn't really want that anymore. It wasn't appealing to me, which is why I wanted something a little bit more compartmentalized. Now, aside from the tech stuff that is important for me to go about my day job. There's also ample room in there for me to pack a pair of sneakers when I'm walking home, as well as additional space there for when you need to pick up some last minute groceries for dinner that night. And so there's heaps of room. There's also these front pockets. There's a special dedicated key hook here so you know where everything is, even your small things. And so it should come as no surprise that this bag comes highly recommended from me. I also know that a lot of you have taken up my recommendation of this bag and you haven't been disappointed. I've received a lot of DMs from people reaching out to tell me that they love their Bellroy tote pack. And so you can take my word for it and the word of my peeps that this bag is the business. Also, this comes in a heap of colors. I'm not sure whether my specific color is still available, but there are heaps of colors that are similar because Bellroy's aesthetic is very minimal. They use a lot of neutral tones. So you won't struggle to find a color that you really like. Now, 
Now we have the Venture Ready bag, which is a very functional backpack. And to get to the main compartment, these waterproof zips, they actually open right up to make for very easy packing. Notably, this dedicated laptop section here houses a 16 inch MacBook comfortably. And obviously it swallows up my 15 inch work laptop that is smaller because Max. There's a dedicated tablet section here for those of you that also carry an iPad when you are carrying your laptop around or, you know, one or the other. I like to use this for documents though that I take home with me for work. And internally, it's also got these two meshed zipped compartments. The mesh, again, provides that flexibility for all of your knickknacks, for things that might be a bit bulky, but it just keeps everything really nice and secure. And when you zip it back up again, it has a second compartment for quick access, like so. Quick access compartment looks like this. It's compartmentalized as well, which means that all your little knickknacks, like your wallet or your keys, if you want to keep things up there, they are all organized in their own pouch as well. There's also two little slip pockets on the side where you can actually house your drink bottle. There's also a key hook. That is really, really useful. At the moment, I have a Lucas's paw paw in there, but know that it actually fits a water bottle. There is a zip section on one side, on the other side, there is a pouch. Now it's a very functional backpack as I have illustrated, but this also has a very outdoorsy personality to it. And it has been designed for you to be able to take with you for your outdoorsy pursuits. So I have taken this with me on several day hikes. It is very functional for that purpose. There are a few things that make it appropriate as well. There's this lumbar support, which makes it really comfortable when you're walking. There's the sternum strap, obviously, so you don't have to constantly adjust your shoulder straps. And there's all these little functional hooks here for you to hang your things. And so I think I connected a carabiner and we had my coffee mug just on there because whenever we go on our hikes, we take a little thermos and have hot drinks because we are old people like that. It's just got this really durable fabric that's not high maintenance, that just makes it really comfortable for you to use for your outdoor things as well. And so what differentiates me carrying this bag from my Tokyo tote pack to the office is if I know I'm going to be carrying heavy things with me that day, either I'm gonna do a big shop on the way home from Woolies or I've got my full gym gear in there because I'm gonna walk home, then I will take the Venture Ready bag instead of my tote pack because it's got sternum strap, which makes it really comfortable for that active purpose. So I'm not sure whether I mentioned it earlier, but this bag has 26 liter volume capacity, so it definitely packs a punch. It's also great for light travel, an overnight trip somewhere because it's so easy to pack, the fact that it just opens right up. This bag is an excellent bag, very well made, And this is the Via Work Pack. As you can see, it is a more minimal sort of baby sister version of the Tokyo Tote Pack. It's minimal in its aesthetic and it's a little bit more simplistic inside in terms of the compartments. I actually use this bag today, it's my iPad. I'll just take that out. This Via Work Pack still has all of that internal organization that you would expect from a Bellroy bag. So it's still got a dedicated padded laptop section. It's still got that mesh flexible pocket, which you will really come to love. And it's also got this front zipped section here, which has the dedicated key hook. And it's also got these internal slip pockets where you can put your wallet and pens and all of the things that you need to do your business for the day. There's also this sturdy strap which works as a pass-through strap for you to put through your handles of your suitcase when you are traveling. So it just makes it all very streamlined and functional and just very smart looking. Volume capacity I'm gonna pop up here and it also comfortably fits my 16 inch MacBook. Now if you don't carry as much with you to work and you keep things minimal and streamlined, then this bag would definitely be suited to your lifestyle. Now 
let's talk about one of their OG bags, which is the classic backpack, which my older two boys have in the regular size and my younger two boys have in the compact size. Now some of the Bellroy team recently flew up to spend some time with the Jenkins household and they decked our boys out in the classic backpack and so it's really cute to see all of them use the Bellroy bag. The older two boys are either taller than me or as tall as me and so the regular size has really worked well for them and the younger two boys have the compact size which is just so cute. Same functionality, heaps of compartments which is standard with Bellroy bags. It's even got that lumbar support. The bags have been excellent additions. arguably the cleverest backpack in their bag collection. This is the Transit backpack and across the Transit range this is offered in three sizes. So it's offered in the smaller 20 litre volume capacity which is called the Transit work pack. Then there's the Transit backpack which is this one. This one has 28 litre volume capacity. Then there is the larger 38 litre version which is the Transit backpack Plus. So we decided to add the Goldilocks version of this bag in our household and let me just take you through how it's compartmentalized so that you can see just how smart it is. Firstly, there is a separate tech section of the bag which is this back section here. And as you can see, there is a dedicated laptop area that is padded. There is also a separate section within the tech area. You can actually store your chargers and your mouse and all the little cables that you might need that go together in this tech central area. Now, something that's notable that I think is a really smart design is the fact that it's a false bottom here. The base of your laptop isn't actually hitting the base of the bag. And so if you were to put your bag down in a way where it was a little bit aggressive, maybe you just attended a meeting that could have been in an email, yada, yada. It means that you won't have a heart attack if your bag were to hit the ground. So everything is just protected. So that's the tech section. The main compartment opens up very similarly to the Venture Ready Pack, which I showed you earlier. And it opens up like this. Huzzah! So there are these mesh compartment areas as well that offer you that flexibility. It's got these compression straps. And so if you were taking this bag with you on a short trip, then you can use these just to keep everything just all neat and tidy. At the top of the bag is a separate zipped off section, which is ideal for your work pass or sunglasses or AirPods, just a quick access area separate from the other two. So you don't have to open this big cavern of your bag to try and reach something small. And then of course there is the front pocket here with a little key hook as well. And it's got these slits inside so you can keep whatever it is that you wanna keep in there. I typically keep my card holder in there. Everything has a place in this bag, which is why I say it is the smartest bag out of their backpack collection. Also, it's got this lumbar support, which is curved to mimic the shape of your back. These straps are padded, noticeably so and it's got an adjustable sternum strap. So I've taken this guy to work. My husband's also taken this guy to work and he cycles in. And my husband's also worn this on one of our recent day hikes as well. And so it's one of those multi-purpose, very functional bags. So that rounds out the backpack category. 
Now I have a tote bag that I'm going to share with you, which is one of the newer releases for Bellroy. Presenting the Tokyo Wonder Tote. This is in the same family as my Tokyo Tote Pack. Now this is one of their newer bags. This is actually the larger size of the Wonder Tote. There is a smaller size that they have available. So I'll pop the volume capacity just on the screen here so you can have a reference guide. But this is such a functional tote. It fits so much, particularly because it's the larger size. You might also recognize this bag after I recently shared that I featured in Bellroy's recent work campaign. I spent the day with Bellroy shooting footage for both this bag and another bag that'll feature later on in this video. There is a vlog coming and so you'll be able to see more of the behind the scenes action there. But honestly, pinching myself all day to be involved. I'm just gonna show you what's inside. Now my 16 inch MacBook, particularly in the larger Wonder Tote, is completely swallowed up in the dedicated laptop section. There is just ample room for it. And you know, there's heaps of compartments. There's a compartment here for your drink bottle. There's compartments on the side here for whatever pouch you want to carry. There is a special zipped section, which is meshy and offers that flexibility that I keep referring to. And there's also pouches on the side of the bag too, so you can keep everything organized. There is a zipped section at the front, which offers just so much organization. Dedicated key hook. And you know, you've got even got pen slots and things to put your card holders or wallets. And there's also a back section with a stud closure for you to keep other things as well. I typically carry home things that I've printed out from the office and so I would pop those into here. And there is a sturdy pass-through strap for when you are traveling. Pop it through your luggage handles and everything is just in the one place and secure. So this bag is just such an improvement on their Tokyo Tote, which is I think the second edition that they have. So this is now another iteration of the Tokyo Tote. And as you can see, there's a real premium look to it as well. This was definitely designed for the working person in mind. These straps are incredibly comfortable to wear on the shoulders because they have these grippy bits. That is probably not the technical name, but that's gonna be how I'm gonna to refer to it in this video. But it just means that you have a strap situation where it's not gonna fall off your shoulder, which is a huge deal, particularly when you're commuting to work and you're not carrying things that are typically lightweight. It means that everything is just secure, you're comfortable. It's just one of those very, very smart bags. The smaller size of the Wonder Tote packs a punch when it comes to capacity and has more than enough room for me to take my daily essentials with me to and from the office. But this larger size is great if you carry a lot more with you to work. And it's also a great candidate for baby bag as well just for all the compartments that it has inside and the fact that it's got this durability to it very versatile depending on how you want to use it Now we move into the crossbody slash fanny pack category and I'm excited to share with you three bags that I have from their range. The first bag is the Venture Ready Sling and this one has two and a half litres of volume capacity. This is a really rugged, hard wearing bag. It's got an outdoorsy vibe to it. I've made use of it when I've been taking my kids to school in the morning. It's just low fuss. It's also got heaps of compartments. That's the front section there. And this is the back section. I've been vlogging this week and this bag has fit my camera as well as my remote and my tripod, just all in this section here. There's also a back zipped section as well. If you wanna keep your wallet with you, that's close just for security purposes. And obviously an adjustable strap with this really smart detachment mechanism just sort of slides in. I've really enjoyed using this bag. I know a lot of you like this bag as well and it constantly sells out. Hopefully by the time I post up this video, it'll be back in stock again. And it comes in some really nice neutral tones. It comes in black, which is called Midnight. There's a night sky, which is a navy. And it comes in their signature range and green and the orange as well. This bag is very, very popular. You can totally understand why. The other fanny pack that I have also from the Venture Ready range is the Venture Ready Hip Pack, which is very similar in design to the Venture Ready Pack. 
This one here is two and a half liters in volume capacity. This one here is one and a half liter. And again, it's another great errand running bag, but it's also got that additional facet of being really durable and very low fuss with the hard wearing material that's been used. This is the Ranger Green color, by the way, and it's a great color, a bit of an accent color, given all of the um, navies and burgundies and blacks that I have in my collection. Now, even though it's a durable bag, it's also very comfortable to wear because there is that padding at the back. And so while it's designed as a hip pack, I much prefer wearing it slung across my shoulder, like so. Very comfortable, quick access to the things. And to round out the crossbody category, I have here a bag that I've actually been using today. This is the Tokyo Crossbody, which is a more dressy version and has a little bit more of a structured shape to it in comparison to the more rugged looking Venture Ready sling packs that I just showed you. This is the second bag style that I shot as part of Bell Rose campaign. So I'll be able to share some campaign imagery with you as I talk through this bag. This is in their durable signature black fabric. And I'll just show you what it looks like with all of the things that I've packed in there today. So I've got my Sunny's K, I've got my keys. I'll just take everything out actually so that you can see what it looks like internally. The bag's emptied and it's got that main sort of compartment area there. Then there are these side pockets and there are these other side pockets here which have these little compartments. There's also a pocket at the back to store some additional things and I'll pop the volume capacity up here for reference. I have really embraced crossbody bags recently. I've done a whole video on my channel summarizing all of my crossbody bags and I've done a whole fanny pack review over on an Instagram reel. This one is a really nice departure from the relaxed nature that bum bags can have. I really like how structured it is and I have worn it on date nights and things like that. It just is just low fuss, comfortable to wear and it looks dressy enough for that purpose too. So yes, this is the Tokyo Crossbody. Before I move on to the accessories that I wanted to share with you from the brand, there is one more bag that I wanted to share. This is one of their lightweight and durable bags. This is their light duffel bag, which is just Bellroy's version of a duffel bag, your go-to dumping ground if you have a lot of things that you want to take with you, either to the gym, for a short trip somewhere. This is made of a really durable and rugged fabric, but it is incredibly lightweight. It's three times lighter than their regular fabric as well, and it's made from a recycled material. It comes with a shoulder strap, so you can carry it both using the top handles or the shoulder strap, which I just store inside the bag. And inside, there is just a ton of room. There's all these internal compartments as well, these side compartments. We all have a duffel bag in our lives, likely made from a very heavyweight canvas fabric. This lightweight version though, is just a real step up. It feels very premium. It still serves the same purpose. Now I wanted to finish up this video by talking you through a few accessories that have made my life a lot more organized. First, I'll start with tech things. Now I bought this tech kit last year. It featured in my travel video when we traveled down to Geelong to see family. And I was taking all my laptop gear, my camera gear with me. And I just wanted a place where I could house all of my charges and batteries and cables and whatnot. And this tech kit was an absolute lifesaver. It meant everything was just neat. I used it every single day, several times a day when I was reaching for things, when I was charging things. If you have a lot of tech gear, which I'm assuming that you all would, if you are a modern citizen and you're traveling, then you should definitely invest in a tech kit. It just makes everything just so much easier and it's less of a headache as well, knowing that everything is just in here. Something else that I also bought is this laptop sleeve, which is still available. This is their 16 inch laptop sleeve light made of their lightweight material. It's incredibly padded. It's a little bit stained just because it has gone places. When I travel for a longer period of time, I typically take a case with me and I didn't want to put my laptop inside the case without a protective sleeve. And so that's why I bought this, I invested in this. This is my dedicated MacBook sleeve. Now, if you have a smaller laptop, there is notably a 14 inch laptop caddy, which serves two purposes. That is a laptop sleeve, but it's also got a front section where you can actually store all of the bits that you need for your day. And so if you are commuting to and from the office and you hot desk particularly, then that's a good piece of kit to have because you can have all of your bits and bobs just in the one piece of gear. There's also the Venture Ready pouch, which is just the pouch version of the slings that I showed you earlier. This is a great piece of kit if you are taking a larger bag with you and you want something that's a little bit sturdy and protective of your things. 
found that this has been ideal for that purpose. And it is very similar to the Venture Ready hip pack. It's the same sort of shape, it just doesn't have the straps. And another great item for travel is the toiletries bag, which zips right open, accordion style, so you can see all of your things, you can take a lot with you. It's really minimal looking, but it's incredibly functional. It's got all these little pouches and side pockets that you can use to put your toothbrush and all your lotions and potions and all of the things. Trust me, I use a lot of that stuff. And the last accessory that's worth mentioning is their Cooler Caddy, which is an insulated bag that keeps your lunch or your drinks cold while you're on the go, while you're on your way to work. It's also great as like a cooler bag for picnics. It conveniently fits a six pack. There's an included bottle opener. One of the things that you never have when you need it, now that we have it, we don't know how we lived without it. Anyway, that is a wrap. That is all the Bellroy gear that I have that I've had the pleasure of trying. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that you found it useful, particularly if you have any of these pieces on your radar. And if you have any questions about any of the pieces that I featured, then pop it in the comment section below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks again to the Bellroy team for sponsoring this video and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.